Remember when we want to graph vertical lines that we need to know the equation. The equation always looks like x equals some number. So for the first one we're going to do, we're going to say x is equal to 3. This means that no matter what y values we have, our x value is always going to be 3. So if I make a little table, I said that we could have any y value we wanted, so I'm just going to put some down. Our x is always going to be 3. So I'm going to go graph those. The point 3, 1. 1, 2, 3, 1. Point 3, 2. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2. And the point 3, 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Notice we're starting to form a vertical line. And that's how we graph a vertical line. Let's try another one, just for practice. Let's say this time we want to do x equals negative 2. That means no matter what y values we pick, our x is always going to be negative 2. So if I pick y values of negative 2, negative 1, 0, and 1, my x is always going to be negative 2. So let's go graph those points, see if we can graph this line. So we have negative 2, negative 2, negative 2, 1, negative 2, negative 1, and then negative 2, 0, and negative 2, positive 1. we connect those dots, we have a vertical line at x equals negative 2. And that's how we graph vertical lines.